So uh, how you doing guys? Andrew, Sarmast here, getting ready for the Masters Nationals. I'm about five and a half weeks out. Um, meal, plan have cha meal plans have changed a little bit. Uh, my diet is mostly comprised of egg whites, a little bit of chicken, and mostly fish. Uh, uh, carbohydrates are going to be uh, white rice and a little bit of uh, white rice, uh, cream of rice, and oatmeal. Um, the, what, I've fit, what you saw me fixing today were my uh, next four meals for the day when I go to work. It's going to be uh, my nine o'clock meal will be uh, two cups of egg whites with one cup of white rice. My twelve o'clock meal will be twelve ounces of uh, chicken with one cup of white rice. And my three o'clock and six o'clock meals will be twelve ounces of tilapia. Uh, what you didn't see is I have to steam some asparagus and put them in my carbless meals. Um, I'm starting to pull out, pull out my carbs for the, you know, in an effort to, to get even leaner. Uh, my workouts, uh, you know, my workouts have pretty much stayed the same. I'm still doing, you know, fasted cardio for about 40 minutes before I, uh, before I train, before I've eaten anything for the day. And then um, I also have... Uh, I've just started incorporating a, a, an, an evening workout where I do a small body part. Like last night, I did bicep uh, and biceps, and then I did uh, another 30 minutes of fasted car or 30 minutes of cardio, alternating between uh, treadmill at very high incline, very slow speed, just squeezing, uh, taking steps, and pushing off with my heels and squeezing my uh, my legs real hard to try to get more detail out of them. And then tonight, I will go. To the gym uh, and do um, a little bit of calves and uh, step mill for another 30 minutes. Um, pretty tired right now. Just eating all the food and fixing it all food and all the prep. It's taking its toll on me. I'm tired, but you know I'm I'm not unhappy. I, you know I feel good, and I just hope this all pays off. <laughs> I wake up at around 4:30. About 4:40, uh, I mix up some uh, some BCAs with a little bit of caffeine in it. My favorite is uh, Amino Energy. Um, I take all my pre-workout subs, uh, and then I go downstairs. I do the fasted cardio. I I you know work three quarters of the way through that Amino Energy. Then I come back upstairs, and um, I eat my first meal, which sometimes is six ounces of egg whites uh, with six ounces of, uh, or excuse me, uh, 40 grams of whey protein hydrosylate um, and some cream of rice. Um, or if I'm pressed for time and I have to get the heck out the door, um, it's 60 to 90 grams of whey protein hydrosylate. Uh, and I like the Proto Whey. It's by BNRG. It, it tastes amazing to me. That's probably the, one of my highlights of my daily regimen right now. And then uh, I mix Right now, uh, uh, a half a cup of oats into it. Go train. I sip on more BCAs. The BCAs that I sip on during my training work, during my workout, do not have stimulants in them because I feel like they further dehydrate you. So I use Inner Armor BCAs. It's got 12 grams of, of leucine in it. It's a four to one ratio, and it, it's optimum for you know. They say that you know the science behind it's optimum for muscle growth. So that's what I use during my workout. Uh, Immediately post, um, I pulled my carbs back from 70 grams of post-workout uh, carbs to uh, 35. I do Vitargo with another 60 to 90 grams of whey protein hydrosylate. And then, uh, as you can see, I was making my meals for the day. My next meal will be two cups of the egg whites with uh, a cup of white rice. And then 12 o'clock will be 12 ounces of chicken breast with a cup of white rice. And then from then on, I will not eat any carbohydrates. It'll be uh, tilapia, which is 12 ounces at 3 o'clock, 12 ounces at 6 o'clock. Depending on how I feel at the end of the day, for my 9 o'clock meal, I can either do another protein shake um, or a little bit of protein shake 
uh, sometimes I'll do, um, you know, a protein shake, which is, you know, a shaker cup, but I won't put as much protein powder in there. And then I'll do some whole food, like some chicken and maybe tilapia. I'm not a huge fan of fish. Um, in fact, I hate it, but I know it's, it's, you know, it's the protein source that will get you the very leanest. So, you know, I suffer through it and I eat what I have to do. You know, I keep telling myself as I'm doing all this work, uh, you know, suck it up and, you know, because everybody else is doing it, you know, you're no different. So that's kind of what my day looks like right now. If you want to keep following my contest prep or keep up with what I'm doing, uh, you can uh, go to maxsportsnutrition.com and um, we're going to be doing some more training videos and, and I know these food prep videos are, are really, you know, what people look for. We got a lot of hits on the last one uh, and the last ones that we've done. Sorry that this one's a little bit boring, but you know, when you get down and dirty with uh, your contest prep and if you're trying to get as lean as possible, there's two things. Your, your meal plans are going to be pretty boring and you're going to suffer. If you're not suffering, I've told people this many times, if, if you're happy when you're, you're you know, trying to get really lean, then uh, something's wrong because it's not fun.